Hey, it's Mike. Let's talk about Reaper. Today I'd like to talk about track templates. Track templates can be used to quickly reproduce any type of complicated track layout that you may have and want to recall in later sessions. Let's take a look. For this example, I'll be setting up to record some drums. I'll start by adding multiple tracks. And I'll go through and name each of these tracks for the instrument that they're going to capture. I'll set up the panning the way that I'd like and create a folder to contain all of these. Now I'll need to go and set up my routing so that each track is routed to the correct input on my audio interface. Once I have the tracks configured the way that I'd like, I'll click the first track and then hold shift and click the last one right click and choose save tracks as template give the template the desired name and click save now whenever you create a new project if you'd like to recall that same template you simply right click in the track control panel choose insert track from template and choose the name that you saved and as you can see the tracks have come across just as we configured them before with the panning preserved the folders preserved and also the routing is preserved that's it for this episode. I hope it helps. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and if you'd like to support the channel, you can do so by clicking the link below to buy me a coffee. I do like coffee. I mean, who doesn't? Why do you keep calling them lessons if you're not really teaching? I mean, it's like you're just showing a quick tip or something. It's more like a... I don't know, a nugget of truth or something.